guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Miranda if you're new here and if you're not new here, thank you so much for subscribing and if you haven't subscribed, please be sure to subscribe to me and make videos every week or try my best to. Today I wanted to share with you two different kind of pacifier clips, one wooded bead pacifier clip and the other one is just a regular fabric pacifier clip. Today I am 21 weeks so I thought it would be a good idea since we are halfway that I would show you guys my baby bump. For this project, you're going to need 8 to 10 natural wood beads, metal or plastic clips, lighter, elastic cording, and scissors, as well as fabric of choice. Please, please, please never leave a baby unsupervised with any sort of beaded pacifier clip. I cut my elastic cord to about 22 inches long and then doubled it over. I took my clip and I put it into my clip like this took the ends and put it through the loop and pulled it tight. This is much more secure than doing a knot at the top. Now I'm just taking my beads, putting the two cords through the bead and putting the rest of my beads onto my cording. Once I got done with the beads, I wanted to twist the bottom. So I went ahead and twisted it about four or five inches. And then I'm gonna bring it up to the top Take the ends and wrap it around itself, like this. And then bring the two ends through the loop that I made right here. And pull this tight. We are really trying to make sure those beads do not come off or that the knot doesn't come undone. So just for safety reasons, I'm gonna go ahead and knot it a couple times just to make sure it's really secure. Cutting off the excess, but leaving a little bit and heat sealing the ends. Then you just take the ends and tuck it into the bottom bead like this. Here's your first beaded pacifier clip done. And to use the clip, all you do is take your pacifier or your teething toy and loop it through like this. Okay, moving on to our fabric pacifier clip. I'm gonna use the plastic clip this time and cut four inches folded over of my elastic cording. The fabric is two and a half inches wide by 14 inches long. And what I'm gonna do is take the wrong sides touching and fold it in half and iron it. Then take the two sides and meet it to that middle line and iron it again. Then we're going to fold it over one more time right in half. And pin it all the way down. We're going to open it up and tuck in the edges. And this is how you encase the raw edges. Now taking our elastic cording, what we're gonna do is tie a couple knots at the top. And this is so when we sew it in, it doesn't come slipping right out. We're gonna put this on the other end with the raw edges tucked in as well. Pin it down. And when we sew this, we're gonna tack it really good right here, but we're also going to sew all the way around. And here's what it looks like. Now we're gonna put our fabric strip into our pacifier clip like this and pin it down. And when we sew this, we're gonna sew a little box right here and I'm using my zipper foot to do this. This allows you to get really close to that pacifier clip. And here's what it looks like. Super easy and you can make it in whatever fabric you want it to be in. Mm -hmm. 
I hope you guys liked today's video, and if you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you like my channel, then please subscribe. I'd love to have you. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day.